how are we going I'm just gonna jump on and just say hello how are you <laughs> I honestly have no idea what I'm going to talk about but I like chatting to you guys I like talking who doesn't love the sound of their own voice am I right I did want to say that I'm struggling a little bit with the passport size I think going from A6 when you do have a lot more page, obviously it's not like a huge amount of page, it's still a lot smaller than the, um, what do they call that, the standard size. But yeah, I don't know, the passports, I'm, I'm struggling a little bit. I have been loving it, so I've been using my records passport for a, a what do they call that, personal journal. I keep my brain, I'm so tired today, so tired today. I've had two cups of coffee but it's not helping, but yes, anyway, back on track. I have been loving it for my personal journal because, again, even the slow days, even if you just have a little bit to say, it still takes up a page or two, which makes you feel like you're writing a lot, which I really like. Even the tiny decorations I get to do in the, in the, oh my gosh, I'm like stuttering. I'm so tired. I probably shouldn't even be talking. But hey, guess what? This is Maddie. This is what you get when you listen to Hello Dyer. But the little decorations I can do in the passport, I've been really liking. I really like the little, the tiny little subtle things I can do. Like one stamp, maybe a few, a single sticker here and there. I really like it. I think I'm loving the super minimalism that it's making me do. 
And because I don't write an awful lot in my creative journals, obviously I'm getting more comfortable with that with my with the lyrics that I do in my music journal. To be fair, most of the time when I do write in my creative journals, it is lyrics. Like this is a song. The lyrics I'm writing out right now is a song. It's a French song. Um, and I would try and pronounce it. It's, oh no, I'm not going to try. It's basically, I regret nothing. And I love it. I will put a, a, um, I will tell you the song in the description if you want to check it out. It's a pretty famous song. I feel like everybody knows that it's, I mean, it's in Madagascar for crying out loud. Like it's, you know, that stupid kids movie. Um, it's not stupid. It's a kids movie. It's not stupid. It's fine. It's just not the best kids movie. The best kids movie is Kung Fu Panda. I will die on that hill. Anyway. Also, we should probably stop calling them kids movies because just because they're animated doesn't mean that they're for kids. I mean, look at animes. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Oh my gosh. Stop it. (laughs) So many tangents. Um, yeah, so a lot of the times it is lyrics, so it's usually just one or two lines or just the chorus or whatever. So, or, you know, a very small poem from like, you know, those Pinterest poems that you get all the time. But I really, I don't write a lot in my creative journals and I feel like I'm trying to, trying to, I keep saying trying to try that more or I'm, I'm gaining the confidence to try that more, I guess. And I do really like when I see journals with a lot of writing. It's why I love seeing planners with a lot of writing. I think it's really nice. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I'm just really struggling with the passport at the moment. I think I've, I think I'm, I've gotten out of the habit of looking at other people's Instagram pages. I get a lot of inspiration from other people. You know, like, you know, you just go, oh yeah, of course. I never even thought to do it that way. Or, oh, what an interesting way to do that. So you just get the ideas and you can sort of build on them yourself. And I haven't been doing that lately. I think I've been a little bit busy or, you know, Instagram is the algorithm's really weird for me at the moment. Like I'm getting a lot of, and I guess it's because I am opening my own little business. I've been trying to find smaller Australian businesses more, but a lot of my algorithms are very much like, oh, cool, these polymer clay keycaps that I will never buy, or you know, ka- kawaii stickers that I don't. I'm not a huge kawaii fan, so I don't tend to gravitate towards that very much. It has to be. It's a very specific kind of kawaii. And again, I just, a lot of the time it's not me. So I need to go through my Instagram and like favorite a couple of my favorite accounts and actually focus on getting back into just, what do they call that? I keep going to say consume. That is the word. I was going to say eat. (laughs) Consume the content that I really like again. Um, Instead of just going, hey, I'm a small business. I should start supporting small businesses. We need to like help each other out, which is it's it's silly, but I don't know. I get so caught up in my own little world sometimes. It's ridiculous. But I think that's all I really had to say. I'm trying my best to figure out this passport nonsense. It used to be the only size I ever worked in, believe it or not. It was my favorite size. I think it still kind of is. I have a weird nostalgia for it, but yeah, I'm just struggling a little bit. So let's, let's hope like working through this insert, I will re-spark the creativity that I once had. Who knows? Or I'll give up and move on to a A6 again because, you know, I'll probably will go back to the A6 after this passport. Although I have an insert that Kate made me ages ago and I really want to try it. There's so many interesting colors and textures in that insert and I'm very excited to give it a go. So we shall see there if I continue with the past, but honestly, I probably will because I am so excited about Kate's insert. Um, And I think if I'm going to have an A6, I'm going to get another Lockta. Lockta? I hope that's how you say that insert. It was just so beautiful. And I, I loved, I loved working in it. I have never felt so comfortable in my life in that insert. So I think I probably will just become, actually, no, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to get, I'm going to make my own, What do they call that? Watercolor? What do they call that? Cotton rag paper. I'm going to make my own cotton rag paper insert and give that a go because I loved those inserts that I got from, I think it's Rose Stationery. I forget the name of the company I used to buy them from. So yeah, I might try and make my own one of those first 
and see how that goes if I'm going to go into another A6. We shall see. Again, there's I've got I've got half of this book to go yet. Half of this is set to go, so I'm getting a little ahead of myself, but we shall see. I've been saying we shall see a lot this entire video. I apologize if that gets annoying. Um, and look, my shop opens on Saturday. It is Wednesday. I have three days until my shop opens, which is crazy. I'm so scared, but also very excited. Excited and scared. It's all good. They're all the fun emotions that you get with these sort of things. I am doing a lot of last minute prep. Um, I'm using, I discovered that I can use packing peanuts for my console gardens. So if the launch goes well and I send a couple of the console gardens, if they sell, obviously, I'm not expecting a sellout, that's insane. But if I do get a couple of orders within Australia and the packing peanuts work, I will feel confident enough to offer international shipping. So let's hope that they travel really well with the packing peanuts. I am a little bit worried about the more delicate features of the console, but hopefully it'll be fine. Um, I still think I might glue them to the bottom still, just to give that extra bit of security so they don't move around even within the packing peanuts. Anyway, it's just a lot of, again, just more process. You learn as you go. And that's the thing, you learn as you go. So I'm keen to learn as I go. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm so tired of just ranting and rambling at this point. But that's really the most exciting thing that's happening for me this week is the shop launch. I'm so excited. I've got I've got a little notebook as well for ideas for a Hello Naya shop. I've got sticker ideas, I've got notepad ideas, things that I have myself have been gravitating towards and things that I, I would like that I don't see a lot of. So I am very excited to give to give that a go um hopefully eventually i will be organized enough to actually do a little hello naya stationery store but i'm not pushing myself it's gonna be good i'm calm about it um but yeah that's i think that's it i think that's all i can rant about today i hope you guys have a wonderful week and i shall see you next time okay bye <laughs>